Well, the kickoff of high school football certainly a special time for a lot of folks. But it might have been a little bit more meaningful for people in Fultondale tonight. Josh Gant joins us live with more. Josh. Yeah, hey there, guys. The Wildcats have a place to call home again. A big night up in Fultondale as they open up the season in a brand new stadium. This was the scene just a few hours ago as school and Jefferson County leaders cut the ribbon on the new stadium at Fultondale High School. The Wildcats have been without a permanent home after a tornado in 2021 heavily damaged their school and athletic complex. The community has gone through a lot over the past uh, couple years helping each other rebuild and that's why tonight was so special for everyone who showed up to watch the Wildcats take the field. We have been through some craziness the last two and a half years and just to be able to open tonight with a home game and have this crowd out here and just such an exciting time. Everything's beautiful and ready and we're in our new building so it's just it's kind of like bringing it to completion. These guys have wait, had to wait almost three years to get back into their own place to play on a Friday night. The fans have had to wait. They're, they're very, very anxious to see the product that we put on the field and we just want to give them a great game tonight. Fultondale also has a brand new high school. When it opened, Dr. Robinson telling students that there's nothing holding them back now, nothing stopping them from achieving. She says the darkness brought them to the light. In Birmingham tonight, I'm Josh Gant, WBRC, Fox 6 News, Anderson.